two circles overlap each other as shown by the shaded part in the figure. The ratio of the radius of A to that of B is 3 is to 2. So we know that the radius of A is to B is 3 is to 2. Now, if the shaded part is 25% of B, what fraction of A is the shaded part? They are looking at shaded part, they are looking at something known as area. And to find area of circle, we need to know the formula, which equals to pi multiplied by radius, multiplied by radius, which equals to pi r square. Now, let's find the ratio of the area of A is to B using the radius. How can we use the radius to find the ratio of area? Very simple. We just need to find area of circle A equals to pi multiplied by 3 multiplied by 3 equals to 9 pi. How about area of circle B? Area of circle B equals to pi multiplied by 2 multiplied by 2 and that will give me 4 pi. Okay, let me move this a little bit higher and this will give me 4 pi. So now the area I know is 9 pi to 4 pi. So I can also write it as 9 is to 4. If the shaded part is 25% of B, so we know that B is actually 4 units. From here we know it's 4 units. And A is actually 9 units, right? So if the shaded part of B, if the shaded part is 25% of B, meaning here is 1 unit, the whole of B is 4 units, that means the unshaded part is 3 units. Now you know that the whole of area A is 9 units, that means the whole of this thing is 9 units, shaded part is 1 unit, that means the remaining unshaded part is 8 units. So what fraction of a is the shaded part. So it's 1 unit over total 9 units. So this would be the answer.